And hello, hello everyone. Welcome back. Bog Mod here. Playing more. Cold Steel 4. I read the books. 3 and 9. It's about kid assassins. As you would expect. Um, we're going to form the organization. I believe the same organization that Sharon was part of. Does it mention it in her profile? No. Uh, I think Sharon no. began with this same organization. Didn't come up in the stories themselves, just from what I recall. Um, yeah, kid assassins were like, I don't know, 12, 13. Uh, but don't worry, they only gruesomely described them assassinating mercilessly bad men. Um, so, you know, we don't, we don't Hold it against okay. them. For being cold blood killers. And then they get their freedom. Um, I, I admit, when I first read it, until I got out of the way, and I was like, hey, wait a minute, this sounds a lot like Ouroboros. But no, this is a different secret organization with factories and child assassin agents and agents numbered after the various arcana. Like Campanella is, um, but a different organization that may or may not be evil. Um, if we learned anything from Ouroboros and Osborne, um, everyone's probably good in their own way. And the only question is, do you know their secret motivation and how it will improve the world or not? That said, I think we're done here. Mm, da, da, da. So we're gonna hit up the, yeah, let's hit up a uh, crossbow. Well, Michelin. Look at my love, no sir. Coming here, even if they pelted the, the spears the whole way, that's a fact. All right. Just to work clear, uh, this is this is Michelin. This is the border. Uh, I would not. I would not like. <laughs> I would not open Michelin on a day like this. I would let everybody go home. Oh, maybe I'm not a soul like it. I can hold on the fort here. Yeah. Go be with your kid so that when the bombs come, you can be bombed together. That way, you won't become. You won't let your kid become Batman. Hi, kitty. This is like finally all the brat humans are gone. The place is mine! Right, go lend some of the girls steal your heart, okay? Mm -hmm. Oh, what was that? You silly boy. Acting like that, you're gonna have dozens of girls by the time you're Reen's age. Dozens. But do I don't know, the childhood friends already confessing their love for one another. They're basically married. Maybe. It's a little more complex as a person works with, with precious gems. Don't worry, Adamant. Once, once uh, Cal uh, Erebonia conquers Calvard, you can get the gems again. 
See how everything works out? With imperialism? Mm, some rooms available. I hope you consider staying with us. High expectations. Ah, oh, Miss Rogner. Yep. John from Mr. Head to Miss Rogner. Probably don't care. Yeah. If it's lust for Angelica that inspires her, sure. Cut the dead at the shape of a knife. Possessions. Oh. Too bad you didn't get one from a uh, Rix, yeah. Okay, probably. I don't know why you're even open on it today. It seems crazy. Cray cray, if you will. Mm, I did. The smoking the, the one yeah, that one with the smoking bod. There was only the one with the smoking bot out of all those ladies there. Those cocktails? Nope. Why well, didn't appear here, buddy? A giant fish in the lake. I think I can catch that fish. Let me just check my fish log. Indeed. We've got the four superfish. Just in case I get only the one shot at the fishing. Oh yes. They're like, we plan to destroy one of the salt pails. You didn't expect that, but that's what they're really here for. Ah, uh, the Guardian! Mm. Pivotal over the cart. Oh! How old can this fish be? Four or five hundred years old! The Grand Lake Lord! Oh! Wow! So wherever Trout uh, was the extraordinary Grand Lake Lord born. Well, the great one who shows itself only when pandemonium and turmoil rules the Empire. He glows, strange and ever radiant, will, uh, will confound all Lake Lords and Cross. By fair means or foul, for the harmony of the watery world. Uh, so it's a horrible monster. It's an abomination. Decimate the diversity of the fish in the lake. Oh. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. being the most real in ourselves, as long as we witness the catch. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Me, Annabelle, we're both expert fishers. Yep, I believe I do. Fish caught, types caught 29 of 30. Which 
means excellent for fishing. I should be able to fish. Well, the ultimate fish. Got a bite. Oh. 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 It got away. Come on, Grand yeah. Lake Lord. Got a bite. <laughs> nice. Oh, look at that guy. Ha 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 Angler God, Master of the Aqueous Realm. That's a good achievement name. Mm. How about Divine Blade of Fish, Farine, huh? Huh? It's a brand new legend. Rain Schwarzer. Mm -hmm. you. <laughs> All right, Divine Angler. I'm I'm good with that too. The same title as Stellan Lloyd earned. Compared to that, I'm a greener than this is here, Lake Water. Ooh, Fishing Emperor. Guardian. Fish god fishing god. Uh, let's give this young man the title I hold. Angler God! Oh there we go. Angler God badge. Father, have you got insane? Kids grandfather. Also known as Lake Lord the First. Founder Lake Lord One. 500 years? How old are you, old man? He's done more than enough to earn the right to bear that accolade. Let me thank you again. You did well to catch the Grand Lake Lord. Alright. Oh. Take that, or Ishmelga. We caught your fish agent. Now the waters will be good. Take that, curse. You're fishing angler gone range. How you gotta how you gotta live your life now? It's a few of you guys advice now. I should run that Lake Lord company anytime. Alright. He, he will come running if you ever need help. That's that is that is Reen. Angler gone Reen. Divine Angler. Divine Blade of Fish. Right, let's check out this item they gave us. There we go. Uh, speed plus 10, accuracy plus 100%, bounce down one. Not bad. It's pretty solid, actually. Solid. Mm, this is the birth of a brand new fishing legend. Like a dream come true. Mm, so down and Bell, our fishing tour of the continent is going to be just as fun, maybe even more so. Kenneth, you remembered? Yes, you're right. I, I can barely see. Oh, so our new traveling boots. Excited to go on a fish just you and me. Aww. Yeah, Kenneth! Thing is, I really like you, Annabelle, and I want to be with you always. Yes! Oh, this makes me happy. You're trying to tell me the same thing yesterday? Oh! Kenneth! You could give Reen lessons on how to understand women. I love you, Kenneth. After a long time now. Aww. Yeah, congratulations, you two. I'm glad for you both. I believe, I believe that is a relationship that is, that is true and real. Maybe there's another big one. Well, good luck. Mm -hmm. 
Live well and fish even better, since you never sold me this great honor. You know, I'm, I'm half surprised. Maybe not half. That, like, at, at this final fishing competition, suddenly, you know, Osborne or somebody doesn't show up to be like, ah, uh, but can you catch this fish, Reen? No, no. Though your time, well, that's for sure. Okay. Wow. One hundred ninety-eight reggae. That's a two-meter fish. It's like 6'6 six, six or something ridiculous like that. It's a huge, huge ass fish. Oh yeah, I should turn in the fish. I think I can turn the fish here. I think I gotta go to the airship and talk to... Go to the cafeteria. And talk to... Freddy. Hey, what can I get you today? Sending Jim. Come on, give it a try. Try a bath. Ah, oh, what a relief. No Roselia. Oh well. Back to Crossbell and the Michelin Resort. Oh yeah, the restaurant. Let's go there. What's gonna happen to Crossbell? Absolutely nothing, Mirna. That's what's gonna happen. Always a nice perk. There are no winners in war, only losers. That sounds some like somebody who lost a war would say. Uh, because people like hurting each other, silly boy. Yes, there, are some, there are some very hardcore Michelin fans. That is. Me hee hee. Thank you for coming to Michelin today, everyone. Mech me she. Halt. How many times must I remind you? I have regained my memories. My room is 
Miss Schneider, I am your brother. I must insist that you call me as such, dear sister. You, why would I do that? Only I'm related to someone like you. Look, you got a big metal face. And even a similar personality. I don't know that at all. Your words have heard me to the core of my processor unit. Is this the thanks I get for changing your diapers when you were a baby? Okay. Mm -hmm. Miss Schneider, what a peculiar yet fascinating family tree. Mm -hmm. Actually, came up when I was talking to somebody in the comments about interesting family trees. Okay. I want to talk about that briefly. So, uh, actually, better to do this on the airship. Because family tree is an interesting topic. Okay, so this is Reen. He has a mystery mom. His dad is the reincarnation of an emperor and the current leader of a country. And he has his dad's heart in him because of magic demon monsters. Laura also has a missing mom of unknownness. Um, not a lot of details there, same with sick. Except her dad is is one of the ultimate swordsmen of the country. Uh, Yuna's parents are normal. It's kind of weird. Uh, Sarah, her dad was an elite Jaeger. I uh, don't know much about her mom. Seems to be a bit of a running trend in a lot of these. Kurt. Now, Kurt's dad we don't know about, but he is also one of the ultimate swordsmen in the realm. His, her his mom is very good with the spear, the stabby stick. Uh, Emma's mom with a witch. I don't know much about her dad. Don't know anything about Crow's parents. He was raised by his grandpa. Um, his grandpa, of course, killed by, if you want to believe, if you want to accept Crow's line of reasoning, killed by Reen's dad. Um, your parents were a test tube. Your parents murdered by, probably murdered by one of your uncles. And also, uh, uh yeah. Ash, is your parents dead? Lisa, uh, your mom is this, I don't know, emotionless military contractor now. She makes weapons of mass destruction for the government. Um, and your dad, your dad was a super inventor even before uh, he was possessed by the spirit of the gnomes. You're kind of like Reen in that respect. It's kind of weird. Elliot, I uh, don't know much about your mom. Again, very common thing. Uh, dad, super warrior. He's a general in the military. Uh, missing mom. God, that happens so much. And, um... Governor of, of Heimdall. Yusis, your dad was a leader of the four great houses. Your brother. Part of the government. Fee. Uh, we don't know. Could be anything. Adopted dad was the greatest, um... Or one of the two greatest, uh... Mercenaries in the country, in the in the world, really. Gaius, oh yeah, your parents are alive and normal. So strange. Uh, Dad is one of the four great houses. Who knows? Raised in from childhood. Uh, Dad and mom are both super inventors. Uh, Dad's dead, but Dad was one of the two greatest guys in the world. Don't know about you. Oh. So is it really just... Is it really just, you know, who has like just completely normal, like they're not like top generals or ultimate swordsmen, anything like that. They're just... Her dad works at the local resort and her mom has is a, house, is a housewife and You know, you're the weirdo in the group. You realize that's a, that's what that kind of uh, family makes you. You're the weirdo. Anyways, we'll take our break there. 
come back soon to finish exploring Michelin. Thank you all for watching, of course. I'll see you all soon. Okay.